If there's KFC in United States, there's JFC in Bali. Good morning guys. It's 8 a.m. in the morning and I'm about to head to the gym right now. And this, this is actually where, where I live. And let me just show you around my guest house. So if you just walk a little bit up here, there's a little kitchen area. Where you can just relax and cook your own meal. And there's also some pools and bean bags. You can just chillax, just do, do whatever you want. And it also looks pretty at night as well. So today is Sunday, which means handstand class on the beach. So every Sunday, Ian and I, Ian is the owner of the gym I work at, we teach a one hour of handstand class at the private lawn in the hotel. And this private lawn is facing the beach. And when you come, you also get a fruit smoothie made by the hotel and all of this for 100,000 per day that's the bargain so if you have an interest in it uh, please check it out if you're in, if you happen to be in Bali it's gonna be a lot of fun Just arrived at the private lawn, and that's the beach. Up yet? You haven't warmed up, right? Uh, I'm just gonna do a little bit right now. Yeah. A little more, maybe. You know, you know, first handstand of the day is always pretty rough. <laughs> it's always very rough. Yeah. Yeah. You wanna see who, who can lo hold longer? On the first handstand. Yeah, first handstand. Okay. Sure. Yeah. The sure. form doesn't have to be perfect. Yeah. Just has to be decent enough. Okay. So no super arching. No super arching. That's okay. it. Yeah. Decent. Okay. Okay. Yeah, it's gonna be our first handstand before anyone gets here and. That's where we'll be doing our handstand workshop today. Okay, three, two, one, go. If you happen to be in Bali, especially in Changu, come visit us and do some handstand with us every Sunday, 10 a.m. at Haven Suites Hotel. See you there. A few moments later. If there's KFC in United States, there's JFC in Bali. So I've been wanting to try this place, the JFC, a lot because there's so many places around this area. Oh, by the way, I come from Korea where 
We have the best fried chicken places in all around the world. So my standards are going to be up here. I just came from a workout and I thought I'll just give this a try as a post-workout meal. But first, let me show you my workout really quick. I got two legs, two, two wings. Uh huh. Sorry if it's like too loud in here because this place is like right in the middle of the road and there's so much traffic going on. But I got two wings and two legs. The filet it was nine thousand, and for one leg it was eleven thousand. So, which is a little bit pricier than I thought. I thought this place would be like super cheap. Okay, let's try how it is. First off, the leg. Not bad. So I honestly did not have a high expectation for this place, but it's actually not as greasy as I thought it would be. Okay, now I'll try the wing. actually a little bit greasier and I think there's actually decent enough decent amount of meat in here um, there's actually not much fries uh, so a lot of them are actually instead of just pure meat which is surprising so I think maybe it's for just one leg I'm guessing maybe 12 grams of protein in there So I just finished three, and this is actually my first time eating not really a health, unhealthy food in Bali. So it's actually hard for me to finish the fourth one. Uh, I honestly don't really want to eat it. Uh, like it just tastes very unhealthy, you know. I'll give it probably one out of five for environment or atmosphere. It's in the middle of the road and it's just so loud. Uh, you get all kinds of like pollution all inside the restaurant. But that's pretty much how it is for most of the Bali restaurants. But still, uh, it was too loud for me. And for taste, it was actually surprisingly better than I thought it would be. But it wasn't so great that I could enjoy all four of them. After I ate just one, I think I got sort of got tired of eating and yeah, so I'll give it two out of five stars for taste and for value. I think it's, it's very good valued. Um, this is a place where 
not many Westerners will go, but I think it's a place that su is more suitable for locals because it's a lot cheaper. And the price was pretty reasonable. So I'll give it four stars out of five for value. And the question of the day is, will I come back here? Probably not. I mean, it's, I'm in Bali right now where there's so many healthy options. So no, I'm gonna say goodbye to Jaya, Mr. Jaya right here, JFC. Bye. Probably won't see you anymore.